What is up? Globetrotters. What I'd like to do for the GeoGuessr Daily Challenge is we are incepted into a location somewhere in the world. We've got to move around, figure out where we are. And folks, if you think you know where we are, please feel free to shout out the answers. But as always, no Googling, you dirty Googlers. Okay, let's go. Grass, grains, and hops. Food court bistro. Hey, where's unbalanced splits? Are we in Singapore? I know you're here on balance splits. We're entering wheel clamp zone. This just smacks of Singapore. He's like, yes. <laughs> it is, isn't it? This is totally this is totally Singapore. Let's go. Topayo is north central. Thank you. Where do you suppose we are here, sir? Let's get a fucking 5K. We got a Singaporean in the chat. Ang Mo Kyo Avenue, one to six. Ang Mo Kyo Avenue, one to six. There's Avenue eight. There's Avenue 3. Bit south of Angmo. Toa Pio. Is this that highway? Are we running parallel to it? Are we able to get onto it? We're running parallel to a highway at the egg entrance to it. That's the PIE. And we're facing west, so we're facing this way. So it's this highway. So we're on a road that runs parallel to it. I knew it was Singapore as soon as I saw the clouds. What, what gave it away, Jay Piz? Go to Raffles Institution. Raffles Institution. What what direction from the pin? A bit south of there. SPH. SPH News Outlet. Uh, you have to go faster if you're gonna get me get me there in fifteen seconds. Just like raffles everything, right? Okay. You know what? That's pretty damn good. <laughs> I'll take a 4996. Question number two. All hail unbalanced blitz for helping us again. Okay. Africa. Getting heavy Africa vibes. Looks awful dry. Definitely impressive. That's Kenya. That's the map of Kenya. Can you believe it? Extra kilometer goes a long way. Okay, so Nairobi. Nairobi Mombasa, something like that. Can I go? Ooh, look at the piles of garbage. Uh, is it crazy that most people in history never saw anything outside their own country and we could just drive down any street we want online? Yeah, we have access to a tremendous amount of information. The only thing you have to do is figure out what you're going to spend your time learning about or experiencing i should do this for sexy sax karaoke 
I love this song too, Baza. <laughs> Is there sea in Kenya? Not really. A little bit. Mombasa. Oh, you think we're on the coast? So you think Mombasa? That's actually a good get. Let's see if we're on the coast. Shipping containers. I'm going to spend my time watching some Canadian dude live his best life while I work. That works for me. If it works for you, I'm having an okay time. We got a kid sleeping. You'd say Mom Bass? All right, Bo. I can dig. All right, let's go back to the pin and go the other way. What happens if we go this way? It's a pretty good gig, dude. I'm loving it. <laughs> I'm having a good time. Actually, the SPH News Outlet have been around there before. You mean to tell me you haven't been everywhere in Singapore yet? Ukunda. Where's Ukunda? Is that a part of Mombasa? Or is it a different city? Oh, it's just south. Okay, Ukunda. I'll go with it. Uh, hey, when are you going to be playing Risk? About an hour on the clock. We usually do about an hour of variety, then we switch to the risk. Going with Ukunda based on Shakapa. Fine eye. Very nice. Very nice. We are starting off a real strong question number three. Uh, Municipalidad Provincial de Ilo. What country? Nueva Alianza, the province of Elo. The song is called Baker Street. I don't know where it's from. It's from a lot of stuff. It was definitely in that scene with um, Lisa and Bleeding Gums Murphy in The Simpsons. That's where I would have say the the key pop culture reference would be. But like then again, how many of you, of you folks watching watched the second season of The Simpsons uh, forty fucking years ago? Um, Northern Mexico. Okay. Is there an Elo province in Mexico? No, Mexico doesn't have uh, provinces, tombstone and estates. So it's probably not Mexico. Let's see if we can get the sun. Uh, sun appears to be in the south, but I don't know. This looks like Peru. Elo's in South America. Where? Bo? What part? Yeah, we're thinking Brazil. Or are we thinking? I like Peru or Bolivia for this just because of how dry it is. Northern Chile, something like that. I watched every Simpsons episode up to season 11. Yeah, me too, man. I probably did better than that. Bleeding Gums is one of the very few characters to actually die. In the Simpsons. Yes, he is. They never brought him back. The Gums, indeed, were out of blood. I'm thinking Peru for this. You guys like Peru? Is there an Elo province in Peru? Pete, what time is it in Canada? It's 3.26 a.m. in Wales. Uh, right now it would be like 11 p.m.? 10.30. Does anyone still watch Simpsons? Like, it keeps going, but I've never met a person who continues to watch it. What year? The Simpsons, I think, premiered in 80... 87? Eighty-seven began airing regularly in nineteen ninety. First episode was eighty-nine. There you go. I remember there being like Simpsons memorabilia, like Bart Simpson. Don't have a cow man T-shirts and shit. When I was a really, really little kid, um, when we were on vacation. And that's when like they were trying to make Bart the star of the show and not Homer, and it like slowly transitioned. We're just picking Peru. I don't know. Oh, it was. It was on the coast though. It was a town. Okay, Elo is a coastal city in far southern Peru. 
question number four. Okay, what train tracks in what looks like Eastern Europe? We got language. Uh, Jazz Brainy with a up dash. What the fuck language is that? Uh, is that Lithuanian? It is Lithuanian, right? The up dash? No. Uh, D Denmark wouldn't have Slavic language. Denmark would have Germanic, Norse. I'm thinking Lithuanian. No, not Estonian. Estonian language is not Slavic as well. Estonian is Finno-Ugrian. This I'm almost sure is Lithuania. E71 to the M3. A dox. E71. Could it be Latvian? No. E77. E67. Are you doing bungle leakage? Do you know you're from Thornhill? I'm from Markham. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Town of Markham. I guess city of Markham now. Where do we suppose the M3 is? Could it be Poland? More star region. Did, did Kanye sample King Charlemagne? So I feel like it's Lithuania, but we don't have... Hmm. Look for the M3. I am looking, but I don't see anything with an M on it. I think we're out of time again. Could it be Poland? A dox. I have no idea. I think we're in Lithuania, but that's the best I can do. Could be Poland, maybe. It was Hungary. I was nowhere near that. <laughs> Shit. Question number five. So it was Finno-Ugrian after all. I don't know why I was so sure it was Slavic. Gypsum. Where do they mine gypsum? Okay. Jomo Kenyatta Girls High School. So this is Kenya again. Do you think we hit... It's Eastern Europe close enough. you think we hit Kenya twice in one round? Yeah, Kenya's best, okay. Jojo Ebenezer Shop. Maru. Is Maru another city in Kenya? Okay. We're picking Maru. Sam says Mombasa. Dude, did they spell nuclear nuclear on this car? No, they spelled it nuclear. Nuclear. The most affordable paint in Kenya.
Mbuma Glass Mart. Idgam Computer Services and Stationery. Is Canyon in nuclear? We don't know. We really don't know much about Kenya. Can you believe it? Uh, can you believe they gave us two Kenya questions? Kenya leads the globe in nuclear. <laughs> I'm going to say you are lying, sir. We do another after this. We're going to do the, uh, well, we do the Daily Challenge, then we do the Toronto GeoGuessr. Oh, is it Gabagool? Dab Gabagool Star Car Wash? Who wants the Gabagool? It was not Maru. It was Nakuru. I think we got a great round. <laughs> the car wash is just a guy with a bucket and he throws it at you. Fake llamas would know. Toronto? I feel like I should recognize this bridge, but I don't yet. Oh, I know where this is. This is Egg and Black Creek. This is the Eglinton subway that they've been digging since fucking Rob Ford was mayor, and it's still not active. This is the terminal station. It used to be the old Kodak factory. They've converted it. Can you believe, I, I remember when they built this bridge. I was, and it, it's got to be like fucking 10 years ago, this fucking thing. I cannot believe how long it is taking. I got I to gotta look it up. How long, how long has the Eglinton subway been under construction? Began in 2011. Scheduled to open in 2020. They are four years late with this shit. Black Creek and Egg. There's the river. And we're on the other side of the river, and there's a. We're like here. It's ridiculous. Pete, the UK is the same. It's like. 10 to 15 years for a new road to be built, and they're rebuilding it again. I know, it's fucking ridiculous. He was the one that, yes, yes, Jay Piz, he was the one that smoked the crack, yes. Famous for smoking the crack. Oh, I know this. This is what happens when you get out of the hockey game. This is, uh, if you ever go to a show in Toronto, you're going to walk through this tunnel. This bay? We're at the north end of the tunnel. Is this bay? Okay, so, no, sorry. We're at the south end of the tunnel. South of front. Is it bay? York Street. It's York Street. Okay, so this is Union Station, folks. This is the downtown subway hub. This is where all the, the shows are. This is where all the action happens, really. This is where you go downtown this is where you switch all the trains down here this is the royal york hotel this used to be the tallest building in toronto for many many years before they started building a ton of skyscrapers and we're at the south end on york street
Yeah, something like that. Pete, what's the best time of year you think to visit Toronto? I've been thinking about it recently. Probably September. You, you'll get probably the nicest weather. It's a, it's always a crapshoot, but you'll probably get the nicest weather in September. May can rain a lot. June is okay. We got really nice weather now. July gets a bit hot for people. I prefer really, really hot, but I know not everybody does. So July and August can be quite, quite hot if you're not used to it. Um, but the all-time best month is probably... September, East View, East View and what? These houses look ridiculously, ridiculously nice. East View and, what does that say? East View, Crescent, no exit, okay. Can I get out of this pocket? I head Southwest. Where the fuck are we? Can we get to a major? It's heading north till we hit a major. What's the major? What is this? Oh, York, uh, York Mills. Okay, this is young. This is York Mills heading down to Young. No wonder those houses are nice. Holy shit! Where's Eastview? there corner of east view and mason so this is a dead end then right no exit I'm confused. Is this a no exit? No, there's an exit. East View Crescent. I'm all fucking turned around here. What's this? Okay, so we're on Mason at Eastview. Like there? No, the other side. Ah. Toronto housing normally this nice. This is a really nice area, Marin. This is these houses are ridiculously expensive. Come to Texas. You love the heat. I would. I would love it. If Pete prefers his weather like he prefers his women, how do you know me so well, Johnny? Really? How do you know me so well? Oh, way more than a million plus. These are like three plus. Those would be like $3 million homes. Okay, so we appear to be on a highway of sorts. What highway would it be? Is this four, follow 401 to Meadowvale? Okay, so we're in Scarborough on the 401? No, because we would have... Okay, we're on Laura. This is the DVP. This is the DVP south of York Mills? Yeah. And there's the Lawrence exit. Okay. DVP. If I spin around, I'm facing north. This is going to be hard to reckon because I'm on a highway. Where's the York Mills entrance? Far. Quite far. We are like halfway between York Mills and Lawrence on the DVP. Okay. It's going to be tricky to actually get that precise. Um, so here is Lawrence. Here's York Mills. And then we're approximately halfway. What is here? That looks like a field. 
That's probably this. Yeah, that looks like a field. Does it switch to something? Is that a golf course? What the hell is that? What is happening over there? That is a golf course. Oh, okay. Okay. Not bad. Final question? Oak Street. Lord Dufferin Public School. Oak and... We got streetcar tracks. Where the fuck are we? Oh, Parliament. <laughs> That's why I didn't recognize it. Okay, Parliament and Oak. We head north on Parliament. What do we get? Parliament is like the east end of downtown. Parliament south of Gerard. Okay. Parliament south of Gerard. I was out here for trivia the other day. Thank you for helping me, folks. Wherever you find yourself in this big old world, I do wish you the very best.